Saturday, December 5th, and that means it is the official start of the Hemisphere Christmas Games. I am part of the Northern Hemisphere team, and for my first read today, I am going to be starting <clears throat> A Court of Thorns and Roses by Sarah J. Mass, and this will qualify as my dark and mysterious read. So let's see how this goes. Hey guys, so it is the end of day two of the Hemisphere Christmas Games and I wanted to give you an update. Yesterday I made it to page 112 in A Court of Thorns and Roses. I am loving this book and can totally see why it is binge worthy. <laughs> um, today I started The Rosie Project with Shakira and we'll be reading to the end of chapter five today. I'm thinking of using this one maybe for my cozy read and also for a book that takes place in on the other side of the world because this one is set in Melbourne, Australia. So and then semi mostly unrelated, <laughs> I finished the audiobook of Inkheart today. Um, this was one I was reading for Believeathon. This book is over 500 pages. I was really struggling with it. And then about halfway through, I started listening to the audiobook. Things got better, but I still was not overly impressed with this book and do not know what all the hype is about. So, um, maybe an unpopular opinion there, but, um, anyway. That's all I've got for today. I will probably read some more before bedtime, but um, we'll then be ready for bed. So I thought I would go ahead and do my update now. So I will check back in with you tomorrow. Hey guys. So when I, on my last, on my previous clip, I mentioned that I would check back in with you tomorrow. I lied. It is now Tuesday. <laughs> um, Mondays in my life are crazy and so I don't know what I was thinking because I had absolutely zero time to check in yesterday. Um, but so it is Tuesday, December 8th. It is day four of the Hemisphere Christmas Games and I am here to bring you another reading update. So I have still been reading The Rosie Project by, I am not sure how to say this author's name, Graham Simpson or Graham, I don't know. I'm not going to butcher it. Anyway, uh, I've been reading this with Shakira and I wanted to kind of let you know what this is about because I didn't mention it before, but this is about a geneticist named Don Tillman and he has undertaken this project that he calls the Wife Project and so he has got a questionnaire of different criteria that he uh, expects his future partner, life partner to meet. If you have ever seen The Big Bang Theory, it's like this book is told from the voice of Sheldon Cooper, and I am getting a huge kick out of it. So, yes, on pa I am on page 92 and making progress. In A Court of Thorns and Roses, I have not made as much progress. I am only on 138. For those of you who have read this and for those of you who have not... Uh, the information I'm going to provide next should not be spoilery, um, but I am at, I'm currently at the part where Feyre has learned that there is more to Tamlin's identity and that with everything that is askew, with the magic um, in the world right now, she is going to be safest at Tamlin's side. So still really loving this. As far as my projection for books that I'm going to get through, um, before the Hemisphere Christmas Games end. Honestly, I will be really happy if I finish these two. Um, I think two books in nine days is good for me, especially with work and kids and life. So yeah, that is my update for now. I'm probably going to go ahead and post kind of like a halfway video and then uh, post again when the games are over. So let me know in the comments what you think, if you've read any of these books, what you're reading now, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Addendum. I looked it up. It is Graham Simsian is how you say his name. So I want to give him proper credit where credit is due. So amazing book so far.